Now I will ask you a question and you have to answer it diligently and analyze. Have you ever failed in project planning? Just think about it. I'm sure practically as a humanly it is not possible that we are always and that too when we start as a project manager it's not possible that we are always successful it's not possible because we could have overlooked certain areas we could have underestimated our project or overestimated our project and also planning comes with an expert judgment because when uh, i can talk about the software projects wherein uh, there are certain new technologies involved and sometimes as expected we can't uh, the ex in execution we can also go wrong because uh, the resources might not be available or we would have thought about design something and it has changed so all these comes in the picture and also planning is i'm again talking about the software scenario planning hugely depends on the uh, client requirement also if your client requirements keep on changing then definitely it is uh, then uh, your plan becomes weak because uh, i have seen many pro many a times in my uh, project management when i have done uh, i have taken uh, project management work for large projects so in such cases certain times the client himself or herself is not clear about certain requirements they are not clear about uh, certain uh, requirements and they keep on changing the requirements so all these things have definitely impact high impact on our planning because our planning is not then study so i just want to think about it have you any time done over or under estimation i'm sure it happens so i just want you to list down those things and see what you have done because again i'm just emphasizing on the point that when we say that we are expert we are expert project managers we have to learn from our failures because at the end um, failure uh, failures are inevitable and like all the successful people say that we have to learn from the failures then how uh, that's uh, that's how we become an expert or successful right so if you have failed in the project planning please analyze whether you have overestimated or underestimated or it might happen in practical situation i'll tell you that you would have overlooked certain issues because sometimes i have literally or i have also practically experienced it that in some project for example we can take a simple web designing uh, project so when we talk about web designing then there are a lot of interface which comes in and now the world is moving into the digital world right like everybody is online and uh, uh, definitely the companies are more focusing on the on their website more than ever before because to reach out to uh, millions of people across the world across the globe so when we talk about such a website designing project so what is now the current trend is that we need to put seo or the digital marketing keywords so that more people get in get their pages in the google uh, search so all these things have come up so when we talk about it so definitely when we talk about the content i'm sure there are project managers who have dealt uh, digital marketing projects so online projects so when we talk about the website designing one is the interface and nowadays the content becomes very important because the website is the face of the company digitally online uh, so it has to be represented very well so that even you uh, get more clients on the basis of your website content your b log what products you are offering and what services you can give and at the end it is about because they are new to your company's name if you are a startup then these things definitely have an impact so what i'm saying is in those kind of when we are building website for a startup if you say the brand becomes very important because many companies don't know the company name so in those places you need to know how to present the content so project planning can fail in those areas if we have not properly planned the content well or the user is expecting your client is expecting something else because startups usually uh, because they have just started so they don't have a clear vision you know and it depends on the client to client basis again it is according to your own personal basis uh, what experience you have project to project but uh, certain times we can 
fail in the planning if the client uh, does not know uh, what exactly the website content should be or he is not clear about uh, he or she is not clear about the digital how it should we should go online so in the, uh, those cases we need not to worry we can collaboratively work with the client and yeah we can work on an agile model where we can try prototypes and then just release it out and see the user ex responses and then you can make changes so don't worry yes i'm talking about this is a simple scenario in website design also if the interface regarding the interface some people like it very um, flashy or the design perspective some people will like it very subtle very professional it also depends on the domain the client is in right if it is an entertainment industry it is a different design uh, people will prefer and if it is another professional site so it all depends on the client which domain they are in so when we talk about failure in project planning it mainly occurs due to uh, due to frequent changes uh, requirement changes and if there is no clarity in the requirement itself then how can you plan if because the planning fits uh, can occur only if uh, proper planning can occur only if the scope is very well defined you are very clear what you want to deliver so and that is one thing and second thing is the project planning can also Uh, in technical part i'm talking about whether we see about nasa or any other case study then there is lot of technicalities involved so in some stages the complexities were underestimated in such cases also the planning can go wrong so don't worry we have solution for everything and as a as an expert we will learn things and we'll see how we can uh, make it clear and uh, how we can be organized so such things can be avoided or we can uh, have some judgment so that future projects we handle it well